up guys, it's Greeny, and today I'm gonna to tell you about how I just recently stayed in Bangkok at a five-star hotel for free. I'll let you know at the end of the video how I did this, and I'll let you know how you can do the same. Also in this video, I'm gonna to go to Koreatown in Bangkok, meet some friends up there, and we went to a restaurant, and something kinda of happened to me that's never happened before. It actually didn't happen, but they gave us the threat of this happening if we didn't comply to their demands at this restaurant. So. We complied, but uh, it's kind of interesting. But then after that, I'll take you to the hotel, give you a tour of this five-star hotel we stayed at. I'm going to also let you guys know how you can stay for free at five-star hotels. What's up, guys? I'm in Bangkok, and I finally made it to Koreatown. I've driven past this place a million times. I never stopped to get any food here, but this is the Korea town of Bangkok, and it's just lined with Korean restaurants and shops. So we're gonna explore this a little bit. Take you with us. Bye, sir. She's on the camera. Why do they call this Korea town, babe? Because it's only Korean food. Only Korean food. I'm not gonna find anything but Korean in here. Can you go down too? Oh, they have parking here. That's a Thai massage, not Korean food. Wash in. Now, are we getting like a Korean meals or are we doing a Korean barbecue or what are we doing? Wow. Oh, there's many levels too. I hope I never came in here before. Oh, Viking Korean barbecue buffet. Holy cow. So we're meeting a... Uh, another YouTuber for dinner, Julian Glasser. I saw him a few times ago when I was in Bangkok. There he is, finally. Hello, what's happening, Julian? And uh, B. Yeah. Hello. Yeah, there's, this is awesome, this place. It's nice to see everything's open. This, this is the shop I was telling you about. Okay. That you could buy a bunch of exports from Japan and Korea. Nice. Yeah. But it's kind of expensive. They got uh, Coca-Cola from Japan, 100 baht per, per can. What difference is it? It's, it's like the Mexican one with sugar or no, what? No, it tastes way better. Really? It's like the best Coke in the world. Huh. Coca-Cola in the world. What do you mean? Michael Chai. Michael Chai. See how it says no photo? Michael Chai. Michael Chai. <laughs> <laughs> What is that? Cucumber kimchi. You buy it? You buy it. Yeah, cucumber kimchi. Okay. Instead of cabbage, it's cucumbers. Nice. Yeah, it looks really good. What else we got here? We got the... Oh! Ice cream? What's that? Okay. Is that Korean ice cream? Yeah. You want to try? I don't know. Should we? Yeah. Before it melts. Let me see. Oh. It tastes like a dog bun. Same as a dog bar. Mmm, good. No, what is that? Is that? No, you try it. It's like bread. Oh, that's the bread one? Okay. I don't want that. I don't want. You eat. Let me try that one. This is very good. It's good, right? Mmm. It tastes like bread, chocolate bread. Mm -hmm. okay. oh, good. This one just tastes like a dove bar. We can sit on it like eight o'clock because they're gonna be. You good. guys want a buffet? Mm. Ugh. <laughs> He said if you if you don't eat all the food you have to pay extra three hundred baht. So eat all whatever we take we have to eat it. If we, if we don't eat everything we have to pay extra three hundred. Get out of here, really? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so don't take over, okay? So, so how do they determine it? Like ones if you don't like something? If whatever you take you have to eat it. The meat. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever you the take you have to eat it. All right, this is interesting. You guys hear that? If you take something at this buffet and you don't eat it, they charge you extra. 
300 baht. Wow. So I got some pork shoulder, some of it's marinated, some of it's not. I think they had like everything like, like you can get it not marinated or marinated. The squid right here, fried squid. And uh, this sauce, pretty good. So all the things that you usually get, like little side dishes, it's just all up on the buffet. You can eat as much as you want, but if you don't eat it, you pay 300 extra. So, can't make a huge plate, you gotta pace yourself. So I polished off my side and they just got done cooking the pork. We'll try this pork, see if it's any good. It was marinated taste. Not spicy. Good. These are like potato pancakes with scallions in them. They had stuff like this in Taiwan, but I didn't know it was a Korean thing too. Really good. What's your channel? Shove your face with uh, Korean noodle soup. Doing some more real estate videos? No, I stopped. You already stopped. You're not gonna roll it? Okay. Oh, you can't with the. Yeah, I don't like those metal chopsticks. I like the wood ones. This is it. So we gotta finish all this so we don't have to pay extra. Let's see if we can do it. You guys think we'll be able to finish all yeah, that? You gotta finish. Let's do it, Greeny. So that's like nine bucks extra if we don't finish anything. Kind of crazy. I've never been to a place that did that before. Makes sense though. This too so you green. don't. This yeah. right here. You gotta make sure you eat that. <laughs> it makes sense though, because that way people aren't just piling stuff up and wasting it. I like that idea. All right, that was it. Three fifty nine. Three fifty nine right here. What was this place called? The Viking. Oh. Viking. Viking Korean barbecue. Another Korean barbecue. Myeong Dong. Okay, so this is like regular Korean food here. Oh, they got Korean barbecue too. This room is huge. I was so surprised when I walked in to see how big it is. Show you the living area first. Check it out. This is friggin' huge. We got a few ladies in here. Say hello, ladies. Hi. Say hi, Fi. <laughs> I see in Fi checking out the pad. Look at how big this is.
What'd they give us here? Some what are those scones or something? What's the note say? Do not make YouTube videos or it's what's it say? Note say you made me first. What? Why would the hotel manager want to marry you? And let's see, we got a little bar, coffee, coffee maker, some wine. Oh, does this wine come with the room, babe? You have to pay? Like, um, a, a tea and some coffee and then um, what is it? What's in that? Oh, so oh. All right. Wow, this bathroom's huge too. Check it out. Oh, look. We'll be able to iron your stuff. Look at it. You got ironing board, everything. What? This nice place with no bidet? What? Getting spoiled with the bidets at places. Huge shower, look at that shower. Wow. Little bathtub. Some serious mirror going on in here. Nice place. Nice place. Let's check out the view. How's the view out there? Hey kid. Oh, yeah. Check out this pool down here, guys. Look at the That's kind of weird. It's like on the side of the building sticking out. What else can we see out here? Anything? Oh, that's a nice view out that way. Test the bed out though. Is that bed soft? Go ahead, I'm waiting. Oh, it's memory foam? No. What about the pillows? They feel good? <laughs> yeah. Like okay. Pillow. Okay. What do you think, I see? I think it's, the room is pretty nice. Yeah. You see the view here, then some pool people swimming down there. How's the whole... Big bar top. And the pool of this hotel is a third floor. Third floor, yeah. Yeah, I'll check out the pool. I was hoping they were gonna upgrade me up to the to the top, but I guess they're getting crowded now. All right, guys. Hopefully, you got through that video. And so I stayed at this hotel, the Ma Lake Kimpton, two nights in Bangkok for free. I also recently stayed at the Intercontinental in Phuket for free. I think we stayed four days there. And how do I do this? How do I stay for free at hotels? Well, I use points. I also use free nights that they give away. So I have two different IHG credit cards. Each of those credit cards gives you a free night every year. So that's two free nights. Plus I rack up all kinds of points. A lot of these credit cards give you introductory offers where you get free nights, you get points, you get different things like that. So I have an offer for you guys. If you sign up, I'm gonna put a link down in my description. If you sign up for the IHG credit card, you'll get 125,000 points, which is a ridiculous amount of points. They're gonna give me 10,000 for every referral I get. So, hey, what the hell, I'm gonna let you guys know about it. I can only get five, so if 10 people sign up, I think I can only get 50,000 points, but 125 points is a ridiculous amount. Uh, that's all kinds of free nights. They also have a deal, I think this is the platinum card. If you use uh, four nights, they'll give you a free night. So you use four nights worth of points, they take off one night worth of points. So use 80,000 points for four nights, you'll get 20,000 back. It's a great deal. That's what I think I did in uh, Phuket. So check it out. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Check out my link below and uh, talk to you in the next video. Greeny out.